It's been one year since Officer Patrick Dooley went missing. Dooley! Dooley! He was last seen working off the clock during a bromantic getaway with Detective McQueen at one of Twin Lakes' hottest tourist traps. When I heard the detective and his idiot BFF were going on vacay for a few days, I saw the perfect opportunity to make a move. My disguise was perfect. My intentions, self-serving. My name is Raksa. I'm an occult major at TLU, and I recently started my own business as a freelance and spookter. The work was slow but rewarding. However, I soon realized the only thing standing in my way was a competitive job market. If I wanted to obtain a reputation in the private sector, then some changes had to be made. And to be honest, I needed more experience. With Dooley out of the picture, though, the detective couldn't keep up with the workload. Naturally, rather than hire a new recruit, his office was shut down. That didn't stop the detective from getting involved in shenanigans, aka the daily goings-on in Twin Lakes, and it also didn't deter me. It was my time to shine. I wasted no time taking Dooley's place. Things were going great, for a while. But the detective was still grieving, and not a day went by he didn't talk about him. He even adopted a cat to help fill the Dooley-sized hole in his heart. Wait a second. It was at that moment I realized I would never be enough. All of my hard work thus far remained unseen and unappreciated. Ouch. Was it wrong of me to forcibly separate them the way I did? Maybe. It depends on who you ask. Do I regret it? No. If I wanted to become Twin Lakes' number one in Spookter, I needed to do more than get rid of one half of the Dream Team. It had to be both of them. But could I really do that to my idol? I guess time will tell. Oh, hey, Raxa. Are you almost finished in here? I got another lead on Dooley. Uh, sure, Detective. I'll be right there. Great. I'll meet you out front. He doesn't suspect a thing.